What's up, guys? Give people a minute to jump on. Get this done. This took way longer to fill than I anticipated. Kind of figured it'd fill quick, but is what it is. get some get the video up on my uh, tablet so I can get some comments and then we'll go ahead and get going it has been a day that is for sure what's up Ricky what's up Joey throw some gloves on for this and then we'll get going got our electricity back earlier today but we had to throw out we just got groceries because the kids are going back to school next week so we had just bought groceries well the wife did it was working yesterday and she uh we had to throw a litter ever well the freezer stuff was good because it was only 12 hours but uh we had to throw out everything in the fridge that, I mean, mo uh, not, every, not every single thing, but we probably threw out $300 in food between our house fridge and our uh, garage fridge the other day. And then our pool went down. So like I said, it has been a fucking day. Yep. We got ours back, luckily. Otherwise, we would have had to leave with Kyson. But, uh, and then I fucking thought I had the COVID again, but it was not that. Just a bad sinus infection and then extreme dehydration. Uh, yesterday was too much. I'm too old to go at it for 10 or 11 hours straight in the heat. Well, it wasn't even normal heat. It was down in those holes. There's no airflow. I mean, we have this stupid uh, little fan that we have down there, but it uh, did not do much good. So, yeah, I, I, my doctor says literally you're just beyond dehydrated. Go home, fucking drink water all day, and don't go outside. So... But then I had to go out and fuck with the pool, although it's not as bad today. Yesterday was, uh, it's not heat. I don't, I don't mind heat, down south heat, stuff like that. It's, it's heat with 70% uh, humidity. They sent the asphalt guys home before they sent us home. Those asphalt guys are tough fuckers. Asphalt is hot all the time. <laughs> and when they sent them home, I'm like, oh, sweet. We're going home. Nope. Not the case. So my brother and my uncle just messaged, uh, how you feeling? You working tomorrow? Plan is to work tomorrow, but we shall see. They finally ran my article saying that stupid shit with that kid from a couple years ago was thrown out of court. Only took them three weeks to run it after they uh, ran the first one real quick and stupidly. But... When they heard the, my lawyer called and threw the word, we will sue you too, they got in a lot bigger hurry, and it was literally up the next day. She called yesterday. It was run today. Kind of amusing, actually, but fun stuff, fun stuff. All right, here we go, guys. It's uh, one hit per mini box and then one parallel per mini box from what I have watched. I have not opened one of these myself. 
but uh, I went on and watched a couple. So we'll see how it goes. It was a slow fill, but I'd like to try this one again. Hopefully uh, the quality of hits on this one. Not sure how I feel about this ring light. All right, but hopefully the quality of hits maybe will pique some interest. I also probably ran it on one of the slowest days of the week, which is Tuesday. Tuesday and Wednesday are usually slow. Friday through Monday are usually the fastest, so I probably should have ran it a little bit later, but I did not. All right, so first card is our base. We're going Say Hey Kid, Ernie Banks, going to the Cubbies. Next card is going to be last year's Rookie of the Year, Kyle Lewis. Oh, baby. Please let that be what I think it is. Next one is going to be an Aaron Judge going to the Yankees. This is a Mike Trout. I'm hoping it's an auto. A patch is still good. It's at least a patch. I'm really hoping it's an auto patch. I did not see it completely. Oh, not an auto patch, but still a very sick card. This is why I wanted to get a box of this. It's going to be Jersey, 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 and Baseball Bat. Quad piece relic out of 99. Mike Trout. Sick. I like the wood piece in it personally, or the bat piece. But very, very sick, sick, sick card. Get that sleeved up. Got the big fat top loaders out for this one. I assumed I would need them. Go over and do a little comment checking real quick. All right, nothing new, nothing new. And then our last one will be our parallel. It's going to be a Gliber Torres going to the Yankees. Yeah, that's going to eat up some of my top lip. Fucker, fucker, fucker. I should have bought some 79 points. All right, but that's going to be Glyber out of 50. All right, one box down. Not too bad. Not too bad when you start off with Trout. We'll take it. Uh, memorabilia is going to go up right when I finish this. I'm hoping... Right at 6.15. I haven't done memorabilia in a couple days this week. Uh, hopefully this job ends Friday. As much as I like extra money, fuck it. But hopefully a teaching gig is going to pop up. I just got all that cleared to go. So hopefully I'll be back in the classroom shortly. All right, let's just pull our three bait. Oh, we got a redemption. I do see that. Don't know who it is. We got Trey Turner going to the Nats. Harmon Killebrew going to the Twins. Mookie Betts going to the Dodgers. That's our three base off that one. We're going to save the redemption for a moment. And then our parallel is going to be a George Brett. Although it's not numbered, it is a parallel. And I assumed all parallels were numbered. But that one's not for some reason, but that's going to the Royals. Guy still had the funniest ejection I've ever seen in my entire life with the pine tar incident. It posted. Oh, awesome. It's not set till 620. And then our archival auto copper parallel. I'll have to do a little more information into that. Is going to be a Sam Huff from the Texas Rangers. And that will be the absolute last team that was taken. Absolute last team that was taken that was left in the second mini to Ricky Dicky 
or yeah, I think it's Ricky Dicky. Assume that's not your real name, Ricky, or Dicky Ricky, or I assume. I think I your payment came in is different, but I just can't remember what it is off the top of my head. But I know you were trying to get the tigers for him, but uh, hopefully that's worth something and it paid off. Now I'm very agitated that memorabilia posted because I hate catching up on it. And I just reset it to 620 so then I could just post it when I was done. All right, we got Miggy going to the Twins. Frank Robinson going to the Orioles. Ooh, that's a cool one. Canvas Collection, Derek Jeter. Artwork by Michael Horgan. That, I'm assuming, is a pretty penny. That is a pretty cool card. Pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool. All right. All right, let's go with our parallel first. Parallel is going to be a Joe Maurer going to the Twins and Mr. Booma. And then our patch auto is going to go to the Athletics. Short print, sick jersey piece, Matt Olson. It was actually, I think, one point was leading the AL in home runs. I can't, I don't have my list up. Did Brett Ritchie get them out of the mini? I believe, no, no, maybe not. He got the Tiger, uh, was the first mini. But that will be a short print out of 25. All right. One more box, one more parallel, one more hit to go. I'm not quite sure how short print those canvas collection paintings are. I'm assuming it's a short print. I'll have to do a little checking. There are a million different. It's tops, and when you're dealing with tops, you can count on. There's 63 different inserts and a large amount of parallels and etc., etc., etc. All right, last pack. All right, let's just get our three parallels. All right, we got Blake Snell, Garrett Cole, and Nolan Arenado going to the Cardinals. Ooh, that's a good one. Then our other parallel is going to be a Nate Pearson going to the Blue Jays. And our other hit. Ooh, Mr. Myron will like this one. This is a pretty, pretty card. It's going to be a meaningful, meaningful material. Meaningful materials are all game used. Ooh, what is that? It's a little ding at the bottom. I didn't do it. But it is a game used memorabilia out of 25 with the Brew Crew and Yellick. There's a little dimple on the bottom. I did not do that. Just a heads up. Still a very, very cool card, even though Yellick, I don't know what's going on with him this year. He's having a little bit of a down year, but he is definitely a baller. All right, guys, let's recap this real quick. Let's get our hits over here. Pretty cool product. I know it's a little pricey for baseball for us, but maybe it's one we can run again, I hope anyway. I think I do have another box sitting here. Pearson. Parallel, Maurer Parallel, Canvas Collection, Jeter, George Brett Parallel, Gliber Torres out of 50. And then our hits, Big Boy Quad Hit, Mike Trout, Quad Relic, Matt Olson, Sick Patch on it out of 25, Auto. And then we had the archival autograph copper i'll have to look exactly what that is going to the rangers sam huff and then the game used christian yellick out of 25 pretty cool product guys got some nice stuff i was really hoping for a huge 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 one i was wishing that trout was an auto that would definitely have made our day he does have a ton of autos in this all right guys i'm gonna go over and check on memorabilia thanks for the fill on this i know it was a little slow but i think it was worth it very cool product take it easy fellas